Hello everyone and welcome to another installment of the Coin Dictionary. I'm Wu Hu and today we'll talk about this 10 lire coin from Italy from 1965. We'll go over the history, the value, the basics, and any other pertinent information about this coin. So let's get started. This is a very light coin, 1.6 grams, not surprising of an aluminum coin like this one. Uh, it's 23.25 millimeters in diameter, 1.5 millimeters thick with a smooth edge. This is the obverse which bears the design of a plow. Uh, Repubblica Italiana, across the top, the Italian Republic. The date, 1965, along with an R mint mark off to the left near the bottom. That is indicative of the Istituto Poligrafico Ezeca dello Stato in Rome. And if we flip it over to the reverse, we have two wheat ears uh, flanking the denomination 10 lire. Down below is the name of the designer of this coin, Giuseppe Romagnoli. Although his name does not appear on this coin, the engraver is Pietro Giampaoli, who has designed, or engraved rather, uh, other Italian coins around this time period. Uh, this coin, 1965, is probably the key date of the entire series. Um, actually, no, not the key date. There is one year uh, that is even uh, less frequent than this one, but as far as the early years are concerned, uh, since this coin has been produced since 1951 until the euro replaced the lire in, in 2002, uh, 1965 is the lowest minted year up until, oh, about uh, 19, um, up until about the 90s, really. Uh, 1,050,000 of these were minted, uh, which makes this coin command quite a significant price, even in VF condition. NGC states that this coin commands a value of $1.50 in VF condition, $5 in XF, you get up to the mint state grades, MS60 gets you $10, MS63, 20, MS65, 40. I'm not sure what grade this is, but given the amount of circulation wear as evident on this coin with all the scratches and uh, the damage and whatnot, uh, this is probably not a mint state coin, but could probably fetch you know a dollar or two on eBay to the right buyer, maybe more. Anyway, hope that uh, cleared up some information about this particular coin. I look forward to seeing you next time here on the Coin Dictionary with more info on another coin. We'll see you soon. Thanks for watching the video. My name's Christian and I own the Coin Dictionary and I'd also encourage you to visit us at our website, thecoindictionary.com and on Instagram at thecoindictionary. And I'd also like to draw your attention to some other helpful coin resources, such as my other YouTube channel, Treasure Town, which does more in-depth videos about coins and collectibles as well as some resources like coinmeltprice.com, which shows up-to-date precious metals pricing, as well as the melt values of the coins that you own, coinsmetalscards.com, which will both be a marketplace and a new source for coins, metals, and cards, as the name suggests, as well as whatsthegrade.com, which will develop into a stickering service for already graded collectibles. Have a great day, and I hope to see you on some of our other videos.